an exclusive charity evening in one of London's smartest hotels. It's called the President's Club, so exclusive that the only guests are men. Some are Britain's leading bankers, businessmen, property developers. Whilst the only women, like the undercover reporter who took these pictures, are hostesses, told to wear sexy clothes, forced to sign a document saying they won't talk about what happened here. One of the auction prizes, plastic surgery to make, we're told, your wife more attractive. Other prizes, tea with the governor of the Bank of England, lunch with the Foreign Secretary Boris Johnson. The women are repeatedly groped, harassed, invited to bedrooms upstairs. The men were initially uh, quite decorous and things very quickly took a turn for the worse. Um, some of the behaviour was pretty shocking and uh, depressing. Politicians from all parties say they're outraged. Women have the right to feel safe wherever they work and allegations of this type of behaviour are completely unacceptable. Awkward then that a government minister attended the evening. He says he left early, he was appalled by the behaviour and no, he doesn't plan to resign. A leading hospital that received some of the three million dollars raised by the President's Club has returned the money. And then there's the hotel, the Dorchester, where the event took place beloved by royalty and movie stars. It says it's deeply concerned at the allegations. An investigation is underway. Barnaby Phillips, Al Jazeera, London.